I'm going to demonstrate how to use SDR console to tune in radios that are connected through a built-in server. This feature allows you to control and listen to software-defined radios around the world as if they were part of your home setup. If you have a radio already in use, you'll need to go to the Home tab and hit the Stop button. And once it's stopped, click on Select Radio. Select Definitions, then use the Search pull-down menu to select the V3 server and hit sdrspace.com button. You'll probably want to enlarge the resulting window which shows all the available radios. Uh, not all of them are online so what I like to do is go to the uh, right above the first column and click there to sort the stations by status and you'll see that all the uh, green check marked radios float to the top. Uh, next scroll down and double click on the station of your choice I'm going to select a radio in Cleveland, Ohio. Hit OK, click Add, and make sure to hit the Save button at the bottom of the dialog box. That station's now permanently available, and you can select it in the Select Radio dialog box and hit Connect. At this point, there will be one or more radios to select. You choose one and hit Start, and you're now controlling the remote station. It might just work fine, or it might stutter due to poor throughput or might not hook up at all, you'll have to play around and figure out which stations work for you. To go back to using your own radio, go to Select Radio, select Your Radio, and hit Start. Uh, you could also, if you want to delete the definition you just made, go to Definitions after highlighting it, and highlight it again, and hit Delete, and again, make sure you hit Save before exiting this window. I made this video specifically for a friend who just bought his first software-defined radio, uh, but if you benefited from it, please let me know. Thanks for watching.